How's it going everybody? A Pillow Gaming here and welcome to Blade and Sorcery in VR. Now this is a really cool game. Now I have been modding this game uh, on my streams recently. If you want to go and see them, they are down there uh, below in the description. Uh, they'll take you to them. Guaranteed I'll be streaming it again with more mods. I'm also going to be bringing mod showcases as well. Because um, we're on uh, 8.3 at the moment, but... I haven't actually got any of the mods installed in this video, but I will be bringing modded videos. If you want to see some certain mods, uh, just feel free to comment them. Uh, there are some mods that aren't actually there. If you've seen like the Outer Rim mod and stuff like that, they're not actually there. But I will be able to play quite a few mods and close uh, things to it. As well as lightsabers, because I know there are lightsabers in this game now. So yeah, anyway, let's uh, let's go. How's it going guys? I am on Canyon at the moment. The intro is in Citadel. Uh, that was outside of the map because you can climb anywhere in this map. Like, watch this. Just if I jump. Oh, if I jump and actually put my hand here. Damn it. If I didn't suck so much, I could climb in this game anywhere. <laughs> But you get the idea. You know, there are rock faces, you can climb rocks, stuff like that, you know? If if it's got an edge to it, you can climb it. In fact, I could probably jump on top of this hut. That'd probably be easier for me, because I know how the grab works. For it. Okay, or I just don't let go on one hand. Ah, there we go. Uh, nope, that didn't work. Yeah, there we go. See? As you can see, you can climb, so you can climb up to the top of there. You can climb up to the top of here if you really, really want to. Uh... If you can figure it out, I guess. Etc, etc. You know? You can get on top of that big rock over there. You know, anyway. So, that's pretty much the premise of this game. Is It's not a climbing game, don't get me wrong. It's not a climbing game. It's about Blades of Magic. One of my favourite spells. Um. So, in this game, you've got uh, different kinds of weapons. So you've got daggers, swords, axes, spears, blunts. Which have, like, hammers, maces, and stuff like that in exotics mainly just knives they couldn't really fit into like the other categories so this one's got like a hit a, a, a wrist blade uh, a rapier and a dual bladed staff We've got bow and arrow do i actually have my bow and arrow i have a staff on me okay so yeah we got staffs i like using the staffs they're pretty cool we got the shields and we got a potion we will take a potion as well okay so uh, what's interesting about this game is that you there's also a wave system, okay? Uh, there's also an, um, slow motion and stuff like that. Just give me a couple of seconds. I'm after the monkey see monkey do stuff. I need to turn that to infinity and that to infinity. Yeah, pretty much my processor seems to not be able to handle more than four enemies in, on the map at one time. Which is unfortunate because when a dead body is on the map and four alive enemies, it counts as five. So it's just like, <gasps> oh no. But anyway. Oh, we use the star. Actually, we won't use anything first of all. So yeah, you can literally just use whatever, you know? Give me this. You also have a little bit of telekinesis powers. Oh, oh no you don't. Yeah, you can stab people, you can dismember them. Grab them. That is actually a magician, by the way. Where'd she go? Oh, she's there. No, don't run away from me. Oh, no. There you go, he's dead. Okay, magician. There's two. Oh no, you don't, magician. Oh no, you don't. Yeah, so you can change how you hold stuff to hit harder and stuff like that. More magicians, for God's sake. Oh shit, I kicked her by accident. And then you can go into slow motion if you want to hit harder. Because you're swing at the same speed, but everything is in slow motion, obviously. So, for example, that punch would not have been 
as effective in <laughs> Oops, you missed. I'm not going to. Yeah. And then there are spells in the game. Now, the spells, they're quite interesting because you can fuse them with any weapon, okay? So first of all, we're going to fuse it with this star, which when you touch someone, for example, this is the gravity spell. So, he has no gravity, okay? We'll do it again. Oh, I touched her sword, so now she can do the same. Uh, the interesting thing about this one is also it has a ground attack when it's on... Ah, my hand! It has a ground attack. Okay. Uh, at the moment, the gravity spell is probably the most... Uh, the best one out of the group, okay? Because it is literally... It's the most usable one, okay? The lightning and the fire are still requiring updates. Come on, get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. There we go. Yeah. But anyway, you can dismember bodies and stuff like that as well. Uh, if we just grab hold of her shoulder, for example. See, look, you can dismember people. It's great. There are mods in this game, as I, was say, as I think I said in the intro, I'm not sure. Uh, they're pretty fun. So yeah, it's a wave system that you can turn to endless as well. Uh, I've set it so that my slow motion can go on forever because of my processing. Uh, it doesn't let me do it all at once. Uh, we'll go for a bow and arrow, yeah. So we'll just go for a bow and arrow quick. Quill, yeah, take spawn one of them in. Already in use. What was in that one? Oh, my staff. Put the staff down. Is there, a, is there a way to get the quill back? No, there isn't. Okay. Um, that's strange because I normally fire my left and my right hand. So, oh well. Go away free on hard. How many enemies? Total 14. How many arrows? We've got 12. So I might have to stab some. And that's if I hit every shot, which I probably won't. But you know. Oh dear. Oh dear. Come on. What the fuck? Where's the arrow gone? Oh god. What the? What the fuck? What the hell? What the fuck? He's still alive after that, I think. As for this bitch, she can actually get lost. You know what, stuff the bow and arrow. Time for some good old punching. You egg. Where's that sword? There it is, the rapier. It's made for stabbing. The rapier is. And stabbing is just what it will do. As for the mace, the mace is made for hitting. I like the fists, sir. But it does have some weight behind it, which makes it a little bit slower to actually swing. What happened to, what happened to my mate? There we go. Jesus Christ, why? Yeah, but you can die in this game, which it looks like I'm about to do. I'm not careful. Oh, 
I need the dagger if I'm going to survive this, I think. <laughs> yep, that killed her off. Okay, so, oh shit. Ugh. An archer, an archer, an archer, an archer, an archer. <laughs> I've had enough of the archers. Okay. So, yeah. That's pretty much what this game's about, is it's like wave battles and stuff like that. Oh, I actually opened the book. Just give myself a little shield because they've got archers. I'm going to need one if I'm going up against archers. Yeah. Whew. Yeah. So pretty much, like, this game is just, like, a good hack and slash game. It's got fun waves, fun maps. You can do quite a bit on it. What the fuck happened to him? Wait, she died from falling over? That's just sad, you know? But yeah, there's like some cool mechanics in this game, like I said, the climbing and stuff like that. So, there's also ropes. You can slide down. I am on very low HP. Whee! Oh dear, I nearly let go there. Okay, so yeah. But there are three spells in... <laughs> there are three spells in Tantra. Uh, Fire. Which allows you to throw fireballs and that's it at the moment. And also enchant weapons as well. Where I don't have one. Oh wait, no, that's an arrow, isn't it? So if I take my shield... I don't know if I can actually fuse a shield with fire. I don't think I'll be able to. I don't know why I would want to. No, you can't shield... You can't fuse shields with uh, powers. Which is unfortunate, because that'd be cool if you could. Because then when people hit it, it would obviously make them have that power. Anyway, we'll take one of these, because these are cool. And we're going to bind it with fire. Okay, for our next couple of kills. Uh, I need the health potion. That is something that I do need. Just heal myself up a little bit. It's all good. It's all good. All right. Glug, 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 glug. Yeah. So this game has got different uh, things you can do. For example, I've set fire to my blade at the moment. You know, the same way that you can do it with the crystal. Same way you can do it with this. Uh, we're going to classic one versus ones total thirty-five. So now we're in a one v one section with twenty-one people coming after me, but I am. It's one v one. So only one person will spawn at a time. So I can better demonstrate different weapons and stuff like that. And also I can have it in form speed as well. So as you see, this dude over here, he has got a mace and he's also got a little dagger. So if I go into slow motion quick, let him slice. And if I hit his hand, actually, bloody mace. There we go. He'll pull out his little dagger instead. Anyway, as you can see, the fire actually allows me to pierce armor. So where he's got his armor plate there... I can pierce through it because my blade is on fire. Now if he was wearing chain armor, the best thing I can do is electrocute my blade. Now an electrocution blade is very handy, okay, like incredibly handy. You can also like shoot lightning at your hands and I mean that's cool, right? Bah! Yep, so you can electrocute someone that way. Wait for her to finish being electrocuted. There we go, or, or you can just stab her. I killed her with that stab. <laughs> that was accidental, I was meant to stab her more in the chest area, I think. That should electrocute her. I don't know why it's not. Oh well. Oh, I'll put slow motion on by accident. There we go. Yeah. Wait, what? Why is it not electrocuting? There we go, see? Now it's electrocuting her. I don't know why it wasn't before. Yeah. 
but yeah. And they'll hold that while... I don't know if... Oh yeah, and you can kick as well, which I completely forgot about. Uh, the telekinetic powers, you can actually pick people up. You have failed me for the last time, Commander. What do you have to say for yourself? Bye-bye. Wait, she just... She survived that? Please say she didn't. No, she didn't. That's alright. Anyway, we'll throw that away. Because we don't need that anymore. Uh, yeah, so electric you can throw. Uh, well, kind of. Fire you can actually properly throw. This is the one that all the magician... Ma mages, not magicians. Oop. I hit his axe, which was unfortunate for me. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up, damn it. I don't think he's getting up. He's getting a little bit of lightning. Uh, and also, because of the update for this spell, you can actually combine it. Which makes everything around you flow. Oh, he hit, she hit me. You ruined my spell, damn it. Go. Be free. I shall see you later. Yep, I don't think she's going to survive that. <laughs> yeah, so this game, pretty much, you can just beat the crap out of things. And it is the most fun you can have. There are so many mods for this game as well. Like, it's unbelievable. Like, the old version U7, we're on U8 at the moment, uh, had so many mods and so many cool ones, for that matter of fact. Oh. I missed it. There we go. We're going to slow motion quick because I want to grab this. I want to grab his hand. I want to grab his wrist. Grab, grab the wrist. Grab the wrist. Okay, and then. <laughs> yeah, but as you can see, that's pretty much it, you know? Like, there's so much you can do in this game. It's just so much fun. Uh, you'll find me streaming this a lot. But with quite a few mods on. Like, there's a pistol mod, there's gun mods and stuff like that on this game. And if you want to see videos on each individual mod and me showcasing them as such, feel free to just, like, throw it in the comments and stuff like that. Oh, He's got a maze. <laughs> yeah. Nope. Missed him. Missed him. Missed him. Grab his shoulder. You do not try to hit me while you are meant to be unconscious. Do you understand? Do you understand, huh? I think he now understands. But anyway, yeah. So I was saying, you can actually, like, if you really, really want to, you can go up here. I'm probably going to die trying this, but you know. I'm an expert climber. Uh, ah, no, no, damn it. I did end up down there. Oh well. Uh, uh, nope. My hand somehow glitched out. Give me a sec. Where am I standing? I am facing the wrong way in my room. That's why. Got it. Understood. That is the problem with this game, is that you will turn yourself around in your room while you're playing it. <laughs> it's not quite like Beat Saber, where it kind of tells you where the front of the room is all the time. Do I go into slow motion? Can I jump higher? I can't remember. No, maybe. Yeah. Come on, grab her shoulder. Grab something. Grab something. Grab something. 
Where is my other hand? Oh, it's on the dagger that she stabbed in me. Damn it. Yeah, anyway. As I was saying, you can, in fact, climb anywhere up on this map if you're decent at climbing. Which, lucky for you, I am. Da -da -da. When I boast that I'm an excellent climber, falling to my death is not always the best of things. Welcome to the top of the map. There's the person who I'm meant to be killing. I haven't got full damn. <gasps> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, grab it. <laughs> okay, I wasn't actually meant to do that. I wonder how much health that took. Not actually that much, because I landed on the rope area. Huh, okay. I'm going to have to swing a little bit. Come on. Son of a bitch. Missed him. No, you don't. Unlimited power. You can also just hit them in the face with a block as well. That normally kills them. But you know, it's good fun all around, isn't it? Huh? Oh. Oh shit, I missed. Ah. Just charge past him and shoulder barge him. <laughs> yes, you can use the environment around you in many different ways in this game. Like, for example, you can hold it, and things feel heavy when they're heavy, right? Like this thing, you probably want to wield with two hands if you're going to wield it, right? And it does kill people quite quickly as well. I don't know if she died. Nope, she didn't. <laughs> she might be dead now, though. <laughs> I think she's dead. <laughs> yeah, she's dead. Oh god, it's a mage, run! <laughs> Get him! You think magic will save you? Wow. Be gone, not... Grab him by the neck. There we go. That... Failed me for the last time, General. I will not let you do it again. Do I make myself clear? Always listen for the screen, that tells you when they're dead. Yeah, but I said you can't really put the electrics together or anything like that. They don't do anything. Ooh. I guess you can double electrocute people. There is no grand slam or anything like that. Well, my controller's just bugging out a little bit. A little bit, come on. What's up? There we go. I'm pretty sure she's dead because she stopped making noises. Yep. Pretty much how this game works. If they stop making noises, they're probably dead. Now, you can't combine the fire spell or anything, but what you can do is you punch with it. No, I'm joking, you can't. Oi, hand, hand, where are, why are you not being able to grab? Where am I facing? I'm facing the wrong way again. God damn me. Eat him over the edge. Now then, sir. Thank 
Let go of your ambitions. Yeah, so that's pretty much Blade and Sorcery. If you want to see more content on it, feel free to like the video, leave a comment, whatever. I will be doing some mods for this anyway, because I've been streaming it a lot. So if you want to see me streaming it with music and all that lot, and me just fucking about on different maps and stuff, whenever I can find them and whenever they come out, feel free to just go over and take a look. Grab the axe. Grab the axe, grab the axe, grab his neck. Is he dead? Did he die from that? He died because he lost his arm, but... Okay, let's go for a proper attack, shall we? Oh, you son of a bitch! He's got an armoured glove on. Let's go for the arm itself. There we go. Grab him, shoulder. Put him on the pallet. Perfect. You're definitely not getting up from that one. Oh, shit. shit. Hitting all the wrong buttons in the right places. Yeah, so that's Blade and Sorcery. I hope you guys have enjoyed this, and I'll catch you in the next one. Oh, I'm being shot at. Yeah. Yeah! Don't let him get away. Magician, you have failed me for the last time. Be gone. Where's his staff? There it is. Yeah. Alright, anyway, that's Blade and Sorcery for you. If you want to see more, the mods on this are way fun. Like, seriously fun. Like, the gun mods and stuff like that. I wish I could give them to the NPCs as well to make the game fair. But as you can see, it's already pretty much unfair to the player. But it is way more fun when you have lightsabers and shit like that and you just go around slaying people. And by the way, this is overpowered. This is so overpowered. Being able to hit this off of things after charging it up, which you can do with one hand, and then boof, so overpowered. Maps on it are so cool as well. Anyway, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.